we have taken this really seriously, the pandemic, and as a system, we're constantly reviewing the, the most up-to-date um, literature. Um, what what other we're lear- reviewing the lessons that have been learned in other places. I feel really lucky because um, we have had the the rate of our uh, our infection here has not overwhelmed um, our system to the point where um, you know we don't have the resources to take care of everyone. And what it's actually done is allowed us to prepare and really um, understand the best way to do things. And we have the advantage of of you know, other people's experience. And so we're constantly monitoring the latest recommendations by national organizations and people who've had, uh, who've had experiences in other, other places. And we are also keeping track of what's happening in our own population here. So I know, we know, you know, what's happened with those who've been tested positive before and what kind of complications that we've seen so that we can take better care of our own, our own patients. So I feel like, we are lucky in that we ha- that we have been able to prepare ourselves to the point that we're comfortable with this, right? And that fear and anxiety kind of goes away the more prepared you are. And so I hope that the people who are thinking about coming into the hospital should understand that we're comfortable with it. We've been we've been prepared. We have the resources. We're constantly up to date on on what the best and right thing to do is, and and uh, so they can trust that and feel comfortable with that.